Hi guys, welcome back to my new vlog. On Monday, I wanted just to show you the chlorpheptum I gave to my colleagues and where it went. Also that day, I decided that I wanted my alocasia poly on that new basket that my husband found at a supermarket. I'm really happy because uh, the other part was cute, but I wanted more colors getting into fall and then winter. I think it's really important for my mental health, <laughs> you know what I mean? And yeah, I'm getting more and more into mixing colors and patterns in that living room. I care way less now that things are not maybe matching everything, but it's more, I'm getting more into the maximalist uh, style, I think. Okay, so I'm gonna improvise a little haul for you because I got from the mail a order that I did from a illustrator. Her name is Lee Alexson and I discovered her on Instagram and I loved what she did so I ordered like a bunch of things. So we'll see. I love what she put. Thank you, please recycle. I try to hide some stuff. Okay. So first, looks already so good. And I have a little personal notes. You see? Thanks, Marion. So I've ordered some postcard. So yeah, this first. I also got some pens with the cute little stickers. So first stickers I got. There is like, it's like a plastic bag with a tiny kitty cat and on it it's no bag please because it's my motto. So I got my stickers with it too actually. And this is the card of the illustrator. Okay now for the illustration I'm gonna check which one I'm, I'm showing you. <laughs> I'm not sure babe. They're so cute. This one or this one for us? That's gonna be a tough one. Okay, that's it, you guys. I will choose, take a little bit of time, and then by the time I put that vlog up, I will have done a clip of the one I'm gonna keep so you can see. Uh, it was a kind of a out of nowhere unboxing. But I thought it could be cute to put that into a blog if you're interested in artists like me. Uh, if you know other ones that have their e either Etsy shop or Lee, she has her own uh, website now. But if you have other ones that you want to help me discover, please leave in the comment below because I will be really happy to. <laughs> On Wednesday, I decided to repot a Monstera that I got last weekend. I uh, wanted another Monstera and it was like 50% off, don't ask me why. It was really cute and I'm repotting it because the roots are really um, cranked in that pot. And also I wanted to show you right before my spray, it's like soap spray that I did. Um, I showed it in the last vlog, I think it's vlog 3. But yeah, I'm spraying the plants because we never know. Thrips are really uh, fond of uh, Monstera, so I want to take no risk. And I had like an infestation this summer. So yeah, never know, really careful. I'm um, uh, rinsing, I mean, watering thoughtfully because I want the two uh, soil mixed to blend together. The new one and the old one where the plant has grown. And then I decided to put it into the bedroom in one of the baskets that I have DIY'd in the past. Uh, I did a video about this one actually, if you want to see. And yeah, I thought it was really cute. That corner is really nice. I don't have a ton of ton of plants in my uh, bedroom, but I really like that corner. Thank you. 
On Thursday, I just wanted to show you my new uh, Pothos Enjoy that I have showed in a fall plant haul. Uh, I don't know if it's out yet, but anyway, I decided to do some cuttings because it was really long on that plant uh, shelf and I wanted to show you how easy it is to do. Um, so I, I have a full video on pothos and how to propagate them on my channel, but you know, it's always nice to remind how to uh, do it. I choose the container that's uh, opaque because if I have one available, I will always use it. It's easier and faster, but pothos are really easy to propagate into water. So even if you have a transition, one. It will work with that type of plants. So I'm recutting below a node really uh, neatly and I like to do it like a little bit sideways. I remove some of the leaves that are that I don't want them to rot into the water. So I let the stem fully into water but no leaves should be uh, into the water. Doing this for the second one too. And you'll see I took some stems, quite a few, I didn't show you all of the cuttings, uh, but I took some few. This one is really long, so what am I going to do is I'm going to take one to propagate the full stem. So when I do my new enjoy uh, when it has rooted, I will have a cascading plants already. But also with this last pieces, I'm going to propagate every leaves. So I still have a plant that is full on top, like it will hide the soil. So see, this one will be a leaf that I'm going to propagate. I cut into a node too because I want... This is where the roots will pop out. You have aerial roots already that you can see. So I'm doing the same for the two others. You can see I have nodes uh, at the on each of them. And I'm putting everything into water. Make sure every stem is in uh, to water, but no leaves are uh, actually into the water. I also got a new syngonium in that plant hole that I'm showing that I have uh, filmed, and I wanted to show you. I put it into a cute pot uh, that's from Sass and Bell. I think it's a British brand that I found on ASOS. This weekend, I wanted to show you on uh, Saturday, I went by a really cute balcony, I wanted to film it. Also, one of our favorite cafe that we've been uh, before going to see a friend that just rescued a new kitty cat. It's a tortoise shell, she's so, so cute. On the way back, we have uh, found a garage cell at the bottom of our building, it was really nice. On Sunday, it was pretty slow. Um, we've been in the morning into a coffee near our house that's called Memento, and I really, really like it. So I wanted to show you how cozy it is. And yeah, fall mornings are still, are chillier than summer, which is a blessing to me. They have nice cocktails too at night, and it's nice to go uh, read a journal before doing the farmer's market on a Sunday morning. Okay, that's it, you guys, for that vlog. I hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if not, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!